and uh, it's a pleasure to be uh, always connected to all of you and thank you for all the support on the channel uh, from from all of you and uh, we're going to do this regularly now i'm going to be coming live uh, regularly on the channel so all of you who have not subscribed uh, to the channel or or not uh, uh, not connected to us please uh, uh, make it a point to 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 actually uh, uh, connect connect to us and i'm uh, going to be able to re read your chats also because i can see myself live now so uh, uh, the the topic for which i have come live today is basically uh, the last last week keys and i want to be brief uh, uh, in my in my discussion for this so i'll i'll just put a timer for myself maybe a 7 minute timer uh, for myself uh, which i will adhere to when i'm speaking uh, live here and uh, the last week keys i mean a lot of people have been asking me this uh, on uh, mindwork students of course keep asking me all the time and and a lot of you you audience who are uh, who are uh, uh, who are following us have been asking us about cat 22 what should i be doing specifically last 45 days we brought up brought dif brought a different series for last 45 days last 30 days and so on to abhi uh, 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 given the fact that we released a video yesterday about uh, dilr uh, going uh, specifically in the last week so a lot of people also uh, send me personal messages that we want to do something similar for uh, for quants they want to know something similar for quants so here goes on that request and based on the uh, on the need for something like this i am going to talk about the last week keys what should you be doing in the last week and of course uh, when i when i say uh, when i talk about the last week and the keys to the last week uh, my uh, my key uh, 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 challenge uh, there i know is that uh, some of you have prepared well others have not had uh, a smooth preparation in that sense and there'll be there'll be people here who are have clear completed the entire portion a couple of times others who might have just done some chapters maybe 30% chapters 50% chapters well and not not touched the other chapters etc so i need to give one consistent message to all of you about uh, about cat about the last week to cat and uh, so that's what uh, i i first wanted to uh, point out to you that you should by now of course know not just what portion you have covered and what you have not covered but also you should know by now ki which chapters are working well for you inside the exam and which chapters you you have a problem with and and uh, while uh, uh, skill development uh, as uh, point of view say last week cannot be used for too much skill but yes you can you can definitely use the last week to to iron out the edges and most importantly uh, to to actually make sure that at least what you know you should be able to execute in the exam that's one of the keys for uh, for the last week that you need to understand so do or do an audit of the portion not just uh, what you have done and how many times you have done but also how 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 is different chapters working for you different question types working for you uh, inside the exam so there is, if there are few more question types which are still misfiring maybe maybe uh, uh, a, a circular motion question type or a, uh, in 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 time speed distance or a, or a men women children kind of question inside time and work so if you have got a special a specific question type that you can identify which is not working very well for you uh, inside the exam you know more it more or less but it's not working very well for you so it's like it's like it's if if this is your learning circle there might be a few areas or a few question types in which your learning circle is completed 75% 80% 90% so you still have time to close those those learning circles so you can actually convert those questions because uh, the work you want to do in the last week you want it to give you two questions extra in the exam so if you're solving 13 questions in, in the quant section you want to be doing 15 if if the work you do in the next 5 days can take you from 13 to 15 that's a great uh, great outcome of the work you did in the last week so 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 that's uh, and and essentially the closure of these loops of these learning loops is what you can actually focus on when you are uh, looking at the portion which is not working very well for you of course that with with that goes without saying that uh, you should not be doing any any new portion no new topics you should not be starting off topics now ki wala topic chhod diya because cat is not an exam where you study a topic start studying a topic today and four days five days later in the exam you will go and execute it it's not going to happen it's very different from a from a college exam Uh, or university exams or even a school exam where what you studied in the last four days became critical to what you answered so cat is not like that so so don't try to 
try to try to pick up new topics new topics is something complete no no because it's not going to help you it's not going to give you even uh, i mean if you start your learning cycle on a topic it's going to get uh, completed only 20% 25% in the first week of preparation and you can't expect ki tumse usme se koi question tum kar loge ab ja ke because wo question agar aa bhi jayega jo tum dekhe ho to wahan ja ke tumko uh, you'll always feel a uh, disadvantage on the topic you'll not feel confident and as you know inside the cat it's not just your knowledge it's also your belief and confidence that's going to count so you'll, you'll not be able to close the loops so for, for new topics so then what should you do apart from closing the loops loops uh, one more thing that you can actually work on a lot very aggressively is revise and when you talk about revise uh, focus on the revision of of the questions that means you should try to go just go into every chapter suppose you pick up a chapter any chapter let's say i was talking about time speed distance as maybe you can talk about geometry you can talk about all the 15 20 chapters that are there in cat for quants and you would have a question bank which you have either solved through assisted problem solving so you have you have your own question banks in each of these topics which you have either solved through assisted problem solving or through self problem solving you solved it yourself or you have seen a video or you have seen a read read that question and read its solution so make sure that you you revise all of that once you just go through all the questions that you have done so suppose in time speed distance you have done let's say 300 questions plus 50 questions in your mocks 25 30 mocks you have taken if you have had 50 more questions and you have done the pyqs also previous year questions of cat of time speed distance suppose you have done that much make sure that you go through it once and and go through it at a speed of around 40 50 questions an hour which means that you are not really solving the question you reading the question flow charting the question and leaving the question that's it read karo flow chart karo yaad aa gaya kaise kya karna hai karne ki zarurat nahi hai because if you start doing it your speed will come down to 10 20 uh, questions an hour and 10 questions an hour mein time speed distance mein 30 hours lag jayega tumhara ya 20 hours lag jayega you don't have that time so you want to do it at a speed of 40 50 questions an hour the revision part and so if you have done 350 400 questions it's 7 to 8 hours max on a chapter the of course time speed distance being a big chapter you will have more questions that you have done there there will be other chapters in which you have solved only 100 150 questions so those those chapters might take just 2 3 hours to do and and you have the time to actually revise 7 8 10 uh, 12 critical chapters and the critical chapters for you of course are the arithmetic chapters geometry uh, number systems uh, you know, functions equations these these are chapters which are critical for you so make sure that you you do the revision of those those topics and uh, the countdown has ended so i'll very quickly wind up and the last thing that you should focus on is stabilize if your if your quant score in your mocks has not stabilized maybe few section tests might help you there couple of section tests to just make sure that you 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 re- reiterate that point to yourself ki chalo main 10 questions solve kar leta hu 12 questions solve kar leta hu 8 questions solve kar leta hu jo bhi tumhara base number hai us pe stabilize kar jao apne ability ko bhi apne uh, practice ko bhi और अपने बिलीफ मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंटली दैट मैसेज टू योर सेल्फ कि कुछ भी हो जाए मैं सात आठ क्वेश्चन कर लूँगा या बारह क्वेश्चन कर लूँगा जो भी तुम्हारा नंबर है राइट जस्ट स्टेबिलाइज इट सो दैट यू गेट द आउटकम वॉट यू नो एंड दैट्स द होल होल पॉइंट एंड दैट्स वॉट सागर इज ऑल्सो सेंग स्कोज अ फ्लक्चुएटिंग इन क्वान्स तो उस फ्लक्चुएशन को 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 बेसिकली इस पॉइंट पे थोड़ा सा उस फ्लक्चुएशन को सॉर्ट आउट करने के लिए यू जस्ट जस्ट वर्क अ लिटल बिट ऑन द स्टेबिलाइजेशन ऑफ द ऑफ द प्रॉब्लम्स right so i'll i'll come back live again tomorrow sometime and uh, we will will be regular regular live we will of course be releasing our videos that we do regularly on the on the on the channel but the live uh, aspect of my uh, presence on youtube will will happen regularly with all you all you guys going for cat 22 of course uh, short time and then we'll also help you during the gdpi phase and uh, uh, of course uh, for cat 23 aspirants etc we'll be we'll be coming on live regularly thank you so much and uh, i'll see you soon bye bye